adventurous room. Remember jumping on the bed as a kid? You weren't allowed to do that. News 8's Ashley Jacobs is live downtown to take us inside. This is all allowed. Hi, Ashley. <laughs> hey, good morning to you, Heather and Michelle. You know, I haven't counted all of them, but I think there's like 35 mattresses that children are encouraged to jump all over. They have a safe little area for the babies outside, but this little baby, Kennedy, is hanging with her big bro today in the mattress room, and Hayden has become an expert at hiding. We're going to try to spot him in the background, but uh, he's just been having the time of his life, and Megan, that's exactly what you want people to do here in the mattress room. At the New Children's Museum, we make art and we play all day long. Very cool. So tell me, what is the significance of having this here? Why should parents encourage their kids to just come here and go crazy for a little bit? Well, you know, parents have been very grateful to us for tiring their kids out <laughs> after being in the space. Adults get a little sleepy, too. Um, and it's just a great place to try new things and take little risks, right? And see what happens when you stack up all the tires or when you dive into the tires from a, a higher point. And that's exactly what Hayden has been doing over there. He's back there playing with his dad this morning. He likes to stack them on top of each other and dive in and then see what happens. And again, we have this little baby that's been climbing all over this morning. How long are you planning to have this in place? Because I know it was hugely popular in 2008. Well, we are finding that people like to grow up with our installations mm -hmm. here. So this will be here for at least a few years um, in celebration of our 10th anniversary and our 35th anniversary in San Diego. And very cool. I mean, this stuff was all custom created for the exhibit. These tires are ahead. Hey there, Hayden. Are you having a good time? Yeah. <laughs> yeah he doesn't have time to talk to boring old me. He wants yeah. to run around. And the fun thing, I like to look at the sheets. You and I were joking. You yeah. can guess the uh, age of parents by Absolutely. their reactions to the sheets. Do you know Rugrats or do you know Holly Hobby? I was a Rugrats right. kid. That's over here. I'm on the, the Holly <laughs> Hobby phase of things. Um, and Brian Dick, the artist who reinvented this work for us, did an amazing job <laughs> thinking about all the details. And, and you know what? It's, it's, it's hard. This is the beauty about our place. We can't talk about art. We can just live art. We live art and play. <laughs> we get attacked by a crazy toddler. Hayden! <laughs> so there is one rule, and that's no shoes, because the feet go fly. Oh, gosh! <laughs> So the kids have to take their shoes off. That's the one rule. Yeah. And other than that, they get to just come have fun? You know, well, we all make up our own rules in life. And so kids will be figuring out how to negotiate with each other, how to collaborate, <laughs> all those things in here. I think I just learned how Hayden negotiates. <laughs> no, no, no. Heather and Michelle, <laughs> we'll send it back to you. Clearly it's a hit in more, way than, more yeah. ways than one there with the go. kids. Ash